And welcome everybody here on Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some catastrophe on meme tier Monday. We are going to be trying to find the, or we're going to be pursuing perfection, the pursuit of perfection. If we've cast 20 different uh, name cards, 20 different cards with uh, different names this game, I probably could have said that better. But you, you get what I'm talking about. But anyway, we get to summon Catastrophe, a one mana, 30-30, Overwhelm. That's our plan. So in able to do that, we need to play a lot of different cards, right? We need to play 20 different cards. So that's why our deck is filled with all one, ones and twos of. Um, you know, kind of going with the back alley barkeep deck. Because I was thinking, you know, we have to play Piltover and Zaun for this card. And then I was like, well, how can we play... A longer game where we want to where we can play 20 different cards so first of all we need to play lots of lots of one ofs but we needed to play a longer game and I think Shadow Isles can kind of do a good job of that uh, with having ruination and you know having just some life gain cards having like grasp the undying withering whale um, you know brood awakening I feel like Shadow Isles can can get to the late game and if we need to have a whole bunch of different cards, you know, Back Alley Barkeep's kind of where we want to be, I think. Because we create a random card whenever we play Back Alley Barkeep. If we play a second one, we create two random cards. And, you know, like those those random cards, you know, are cards with different names. So, um, so you know, so like, so that's what we're going to be trying to do. So, kind of taking the back, the, uh, the Chronicler Barkeep deck that we played last week for Memes Here Monday and adjusting it. <clears throat> and getting a whole bunch of one ofs and then two ofs and getting a whole bunch of different cards um, and trying to play Pursuit of Perfection. Also, Heimerdinger should work out pretty well um, because, you know, like Heimerdinger will maybe make some turrets and then like these turrets have different names. So like they can, you know, we play a three mana card, then play a floor be gone. That's two cards for Pursuit of Perfection. And also that just gives us more blockers and everything too. Um, but yeah, you know, like I'm kind of just getting a bunch of different champions in here. You know, we got one Elise for in the two mana slot. We got one Callista in the three mana slot. We got our Heimerdingers, our Thresh. Uh, you know, we're just playing a little bit of everything. So, all right, so this is it. This is our Catastrophe deck. Here we go. Can we do it? Can we get a 30-30 Overwhelm? <laughs> they should add an invincible keyword to Catastrophe so it doesn't get vengeance or bounced. So basically, you're saying that it should just read you win the game. <laughs> yeah, Ionia would deny. Uh... Yeah, it could go that way. Like, going Ionia for deny would give you karma. Which isn't, which isn't a bad spot to be. All right, well, Darkwater Scourge, I have one of these. For aggro matchups. This looks like an aggro matchup. Katarina Callista. So we'll keep that. And then we'll have our Barkeep, Heimerdinger. A removal spell for a champion. Looks pretty decent. We'll keep it. And hopefully we can have, like, play Barkeep before we play Get Excited so that we create, like, a random card. And if the random card isn't any good, then we can discard that. Okay, if I just play the Dark Water Scourge, I stay at 20. Or I play Boom Crew Rookie and Mystic Shot. Oh, Boom Crew Rookie can't block, right? These things are fearsome. All right, we'll play the Scourge. The mobile the mobile addicts app that has the deck list on the page. There's so many cards in this deck you can't read them. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. See, perfect. We can discard hapless aristocrat. We may want to just discard boom crew rookie. Also, but if we wait, if we can play Heimerdinger first. Okay, 
Okay, so now we can create a 3-1 turret. With the help of Heimerdinger. Just wanted to pass in case of... Let me get rid of the Boom Crew Rookie. Want to pass in case of Callista? Thought I was going to need to get excited that Callista, if they had one of those. Hey, QQ. We're having a good Monday. We are over here having fun. We got a couple of wins with Poros. So that's exciting. And now we're going to try to Catastrophe. Not a hecker on deck. All those trades if they want if they really really want do you like the hapless aristocrat do you like playing the hapless aristocrat chump block but I also it's probably also the card that I need to discard for get excited so not allowed to win until you play catastrophe no i'm still going to be playing normally and trying to win the games but you know ideally we'll have a we'll find a catastrophe ideally all right what do we got at four mana fearsome yeah We're not doing very much over there. Oh yeah, there we go. Alright, we're only at seven? I feel like I've played so many different stuff, so many different cards. Getting the beat down on. to 11. No. Bad Callista. Bad. Still only at seven. Q 
keep playing these same spells I've already played before. Nah, I don't really need an Undying. to eight. <laughs> oh yeah, I could have copied Catastrophe if I would have waited till after we had a Catastrophe. <laughs> Not sure exactly how well that would have worked, but yeah, I guess we could have done that. Basically, just want to draw the card. I think with, it's better to play Withering Will in this spot, but I just cast in the Static Shock because I want to draw the card. I guess there's there's also no reason to, to put the damage there besides Withering Will. I guess I probably should put it here because of Mystic Shots. Just in case they like played other like one toughness things I need to withering whale and get rid of that thing, that's what I was thinking. But yeah, I probably should just be targeting the Nexus. Well, even if their last card's ruination, getting another Heimerdinger means we can progress day. I should just do anyway. We get the 8-8. Eight, eight. I don't think I play the 8-8, eight, eight, though. Or the 9-9. Nine, nine. Okay, well, they surrendered. I wasn't going to play the 9-9. Nine, nine. If that card was Ruination, which they had ridiculous patience for it to be Ruination. But if it was... All right, well, unfortunately, we killed our opponent too fast, so we didn't get to cat Catastrophe. Heimerdinger's pretty good. This one right here. Um... All right, let me check out what this deck is. Uh, you get Mulliganed. Draven Darius. What about you, Chronicler of Ruin? Yeah, I'll send you back, too. All right, so you said this is a real good... They're like, this is a meme deck, so what is this? Like, a Shiraza? So, yeah, you got, like, Shiraza plus Sumpworks map. <laughs> The elusive Shiraza deck. Gotta get out of here. That's not bad. I may play that next next Monday. Oh, it's supposed to be an elusive Darius deck? really to do next turn. Ooh. Yeti Yearling can put Yeti into the deck, so that's that's yet another card. I do need to find stuff to discard to, to my two get excited.
just kill one of these things. So this deck is Parade Electro Rig. And counterfeit copies. I guess it's it's probably for the jinx. Try to get as many jinxes as you can. BF one four again. Oh my gosh, you you kill the catastrophe, then you got it in the harrowing. I actually did I did have a harrowing in here whenever, you know, I put a whole bunch of cards in here and I was cutting down cutting it down to forty. You know, I had like Spectral Matron um and, and a harrowing. It was it was one of my last cuts. Yeah, harrowing a catastrophe would be ridiculous. Okay, the other the other one is a, it's a trying to copy Boom Crew rookie. Okay, get as many Boom Crews as you can. Normally we'd like hold on to that kind of card to get excited, but I think in this specific matchup we need to be able to block going wide. Well, now we don't. Now we just do Withering Whale. That was the best possible card to draw. So infinite boom for rookies. Me down to three. Well, I didn't do anything. So not dead. Wow. Quick trigger there. Dude, our catastrophe deck is two and O. Oh. Two and O. Oh. Let's go. Let's go. We got three chances at getting a win at you know getting a winning record. We're playing five games, so our next three. We win any of them. We get a winning record with catastrophe. Now we we've been playing against two fast decks, so we haven't had time to play catastrophe. If we play against like a slow deck, maybe we'll have time for a catastrophe, but All right, well, we don't need this till late in the game, so we shuffle it back. We'll shuffle that. We'll shuffle that, too. <laughs> I'm not going to leave the stream until I see Catastrophe attacking. I'm trying. I'm trying. <laughs> That's such a cool picture. Oh! Could have played the rookie. Should have played the rookie. I was thinking too much about my pursuit of perfection. I get to do that. Ooh, a deck that just copies Legion Marauders. That's a good one. I 
I could make that. So we're just trading one for one. You know, they play Brood Awakening, I play Withering Whale. Trading one for one. They could be at 17 if I would have played this on turn two instead of on turn three. Could have done another uh, three damage, but who knows? Maybe they would have used removal on it or something at that point. Clump of Wumps. That's two cards. A Clump of Wumps and a Mushroom Cloud. That's two cards. Can't cast it right now. I don't have, like, the two regular mana. No, I don't... No, there's no meme deck tournament. Bring it back. Get two more cards. All right, we're at eight for catastrophe. No, seven. I got seven. Yeah, Rummage is a good one to have in this deck for sure. I, I have two Rummages just in, in the deck in general. I don't think I Mystic Shot the 1-1 one, one to keep a 3-1 alive. Alright, Catastrophe's at 9. We'll level up our Elise as well. My true That's not bad. We just have so much versatility with having a million different cards. So much versatility. It's just like, you know, when all the, you know, it's like, which card do you want to play now? Okay, so do I double Mystic Shot to take out their Elise? I think I do, right? Keep them from attacking with it. We get to just go straight to attacks with all these things.
Let's go. So we're at 12. Yeah, this this deck ID is right there. Ledros. That's cool. I can do that. Thirteen. Not sure what the point of that was. Not sure what the point of that vengeance was. I've already played a, a Pursuit of Perfection. Um, Ledros is a play trigger. But I can get a new Ledros in hand. I mean, I think, I guess we just go and attack first and see what happens, but I can, uh, you know, basically I can kill Ledros get a new Ledros in play and get a new Ledros in hand so we can get like an extra Ledros. Well, they can't have triple get excited to kill me because they don't have three things to discard. So that's good news. Made them waste all their burn spells. They were so close to killing me. They had seven. They were so close. No See, it goes basically. It does this. So, like, we get a Ledros in hand and we get a Ledros in play. So now I have a Ledros in hand that I get to play again. Dang, looks like we're not going to be able to kill them with Pursuit of Perfection. Yeah, and by playing the yeah by playing the Thermogenic Beam and putting Ledros back in their hand, I did take the top tech atrocity angle out you know i didn't just you know they couldn't top tech atrocity because their ledros was gone dude our C catastrophe deck is three and oh this is incredible we haven't played catastrophe yet so it's you know we haven't gotten a true win but still our, our deck just has it all just has it all All right, same matchup. Same matchup. One more back alley bar keeps. That's not bad. Thermogenic beam is going to be important at killing. Elise? Okay, no Elise. First big mission.
Yeah, yeah, we got yeah, so we got fifteen yeah, we got fifteen out of twenty. Last game, that's our best. That's our that's the most we've gotten to so far. Costa Cask is a horrible card to get, but... I think it's better to keep the back alley barkeep in play than have the mystic shot in hands. If I have to choose one of those two. Well, darn. Discard this Dark Water Scourge also. Barkeep. Alright, let's get this wrench bot. They are playing a lot of cards. Find catastrophe. We're getting there. Breath create an epic in hand. expecting all this stuff to die to Karina. We'll get some last breaths. Alright. Be ready to get excited. Ooh. Okay. How can I get Jay Mandarda and, you know, play that and have Chronicler of Ruin? I wish I had one more mana. I wish I could play this right now. Uh, let's see. I pull the strings. No, I should save that. Just discard it, it's too expensive. 
It's elusive. It's like gonna kill them. Especially if I have it with Mist Call backup. I probably shouldn't have played the Elise. I guess I shouldn't have played the Elise. We can cycle Mystic Shot by targeting our J Medarda. <laughs> catastrophe with this call. Not Jay, that is true. We do want catastrophe with this call. targeting it. So we draw a card. Discover the unknown. You dare. Yeah, four. Ledros Mystic Shot. I could do four, potentially. Probably have some life gain over there. Yeah, I mean, like, they gotta have life gain, right? Um... And I have, I have so many, uh, we have so many, like, dreams we could try to live. You know, we could go the Ledros Mystic Shot route. They're not just, like, killing my J Medarda. Alright, this is, this is probably me being way too cute, but I want to... Oh, come on, how do, how do we not draw a card from that? How do we not draw a card? I guess it doesn't trigger when it dies. I guess not. I thought we were going to be drawing a card there. Yeah, it should draw, right? That's how it should work. They need to they need to reword this card so it does work so it draws. Like however whatever they need to do should draw. Okay, so yeah, if I would have gone Ledros Mystic Shot, you know, they had the the Vile Feast, but then they also had the Withering Whale, so yeah, like that that plan would not have worked to win the game. Um I still just kill this thing. No, we kill with this. Gorged. 
Yeah, I would think the target would happen before the kill too. I thought for sure. I, I honestly thought we were drawing a card. Just from, you know, like how cards work and things. I, I thought we were drawing a card. Get him, Jay. I have never won a game with Jay Medarda. This is honestly the most... I mean, that was the first time I ever hit anybody with Jay Medarda. Jay Medarda! Let's go. Let's go, Jay. Dude, our meme deck is on point. 4-0? Are you kidding me? We're doing better than, than Rank Up than Rank Up Monday. Or sorry, Rank Up Sunday. With, with our meme deck Monday, yes. The new Rank Up Day. All right, at least driven. I think you may be a little slow, Heimerdinger. You are awesome, but could be a little slow. This is gonna be tough. Uh, I don't know what to do with you, Glimpse Beyond. I don't know what to do with you. That's nice Mulligan. Yeah, no one knows how to play against a random amalgamation of weird cards. <laughs> I know we got we have we just have like the card for every situation. Like what situation are we in? Well we got a card for that. Skitter would be looking a lot better here as a 3-3. If they were playing Draven, I would have Mystic Shot the Horror. Um, but they're going Elise, so I want to have like a... You know, these don't kill Elise. I want a blocker for the Elise. But I will, I will trade three twos. Um, because I want to go Bark Keep. Chronicler Bark Keep. No. Oh. And I wanted to keep spiders off of their battlefield, not give them more spiders. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, Heimer with all those different turrets. Yeah, you can get a lot of different card names for Catastrophe. So that's why I put a couple Heimerdingers in here. So we will be able to Mystic Shot that. I guess I have to Mystic Shot it right now, right? I mean, I really I really would rather play Barkeep for this mana. Yeah, we will. We're, we'll are we be sacrificing our Boom Crew Rookie to be able to play the Barkeep. Uh, let's just do it, though. So they, you know, they level up Elise. They go straight to attacks. They have their House Spider kill my Rookie. They can have their precious pet trade with this. But that, that, that just leaves them with like some 1-1s. One especially after we Mystic Shot here. It's not that big of a deal. Oh wait! I need the Barkeep alive for my Chronicler. Does that mean I'm Mystic Shotting this precious pet? No, right? Catas we're 4 0 with catastrophe. Oh, this deck's crazy. This is probably a bad play. 
I, I am... I'm admitting that this is probably a bad play to keep Barkeep alive. And that I should be using Mystic Shot on other scarier things. Especially when I already have like Thresh and Heimerdinger and a lot of other things I can be playing and I don't have to play this Chronicler of Ruin. Can we draw Withering Whale? One time. Withering Whale one time. We got two of them in here. Two out of 31. So one out of 15. So is that like a 7.5% chance? Seven and a half percent chance of drawing Withering Whale. Let's go. Seven and a half. Oh, didn't get it. No place of kind what? What? Are you kidding me? You can do that? That can happen? That is insane. Barkeepception. Taking eight, or like going down to eight. That was a pretty good vision. Withering whale? No withering whale. Unfortunately, every, everything that, like, we basically have just all sorts of allies in hand, so we don't really have spells, so we can't, like, Heimerdinger and then play a bunch of spells. We just gotta find Withering Whale. The people are my strength. All right, so next turn we'll have nine, and we have 10, 11, 12. So seven, 12. All right, so if I don't spend, so I can't spend two mana. So I can spend six mana this turn, and then I'll have Grasp and Vengeance set up for next turn. So I can spend six mana. Um, with spending six mana, I can only get two things in play. Like two blockers. That's Soul Shepherd. And Callista. I don't... I mean, maybe it's worth it to play Butcher to kill Soul Shepherd. Soul Shepherd's a better blocker on all this two-power stuff. I'll just keep the Soul Shepherd. The good part about playing the Butcher would be, you know, to trigger the Callista and to get a card out of my hand for whenever we play another Barkeep. Me going down to five. Maybe we just. Maybe we just Vile Feast here and then still have Get Excited available. If something happens. That seems reasonable. <laughs> yeah, our opponent's deck is basically all spiders. 
Very spooky. Bunch of spooky spiders. Wait, is Callista going to start putting back alley barkeeps into play? No, it's going to put Chronicler of Ruin into play. Which doesn't do anything. Oh, uh, to block the 1-1 one, one and Vile Feast the 4-1. Yeah, that's true. I didn't adjust my play for the Vile Feast. That's true. I'm going to just bank this 3 spell mana. I'm glad they have, you know, more allies and not burn spells. Like, I, I, can, I can handle this kind of stuff. It's the burn spells I'm worried about. Um, 13. Barkeep would make four cards. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Does this thing only make... No, it just makes random cards. We're just not, we're just not making spells. Sorry, Iron Harbinger. You're gone. They didn't block anything else, so Callista won't level up. They're just taking the eight. I have like a great champion to put into play anyway. Oh right no, Cliss doesn't put a champions into play. Whatever. We're... All right. It's over. I was I was going to uh, cast the the grass the undying whatever I blocked with. Catastrophe 5-0, and oh, and what a crazy last game. We played a barkeep, got two cards, and they were both barkeeps. That was incredible. We beat a couple aggro decks. We beat Karina Control twice. Dude, Catastrophe. We never, ever got the Pursuit of Perfection. We got 15 was like the most that we had um, with a Pursuit in hand. I, I kind of feel like the game four, we may have played more than 15 cards. But we didn't have the Pursuit in hand, so we couldn't really verify it. Dude, our deck had everything. Had everything you need. It's perfect. 5-0. Oh. It was just so balanced. You know, 20 PNZ, 20 Shadow Isles. That was awesome.
There's only one three of in the deck, the back alley barkeep. Everything else are one one or two. <laughs> yeah. But no clue. Yeah, four different champions. They're like they're like, what's going on? Wow, a five oh with catastrophe. Alright. Uh could Heimer be a three of? Ah, I guess it could. I mean, I don't. The thing is, is you can't you can't play that many three ofs if you want to play, uh, like with pursuit. But I guess Heimer, like maybe because you can get you know Heimer makes all these different turrets, which are different cards. I don't know. There's so many five mana cards, and like look at all these five mana cards. They're all good. Like we have to play Pursuit of Perfection, obviously, and then you have um, Brood Awakening, Grasp and Withering Whale, those are all incredible cards. And so then you're at like Thresh and Heimerdinger. So it's like, yeah, if you want to take out Thresh and play a third Heimerdinger, sure. But I don't think you really want to play more fives like about playing like another Heimerdinger. Like we already have a ton of five mana cards, but I think the, the first Thresh is probably better than the third Heimerdinger. Um, but yeah, that was, that was definitely something like whenever I was cutting this down, like, cutting down the number of fives because there's so many good fives was was really difficult because there's so many that I want to play. Um, but yeah, I think this I think this deck worked. Mission accomplished. All right, best uh, meme tier Monday deck ever so far. Anyway, those of y'all watching on YouTube, hit that like button over there. This deck was awesome. Definitely hit that like button. And uh, yeah, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the deck and everything like that uh, if you're trying it let me know how it goes for you and if you have anything you want me to build for next week for meme tier monday feel free to leave a comment we got one suggestion so far of a of like an infinite legion marauder deck of, of like playing a legion marauder deck with a bunch of ways to get more of them and stuff like that that'll be uh so i'll try that out for next week um yeah he'll go oh five now with the deck yeah well you can't you know you gotta gotta try it out first all right, but thank you so much for watching this catastrophe, and I'll see you for the next video.